one week and that everybody's well. Some of the days this week for me I've found that the weather's not been too good so I've not got out for a walk. So what I've done is had a look at my holiday photos and some of the videos that I took whilst I was on holiday. One of them I want to share with you. Those of you out there who like trains, I think you're going to enjoy it. I've got a couple of trains here, but you're going to see a different train. Let's have a look at this video. Well, hello there, everybody. I'm here at a train station in a part of the county of Yorkshire in a place called Whitby. And just look at this gorgeous steam train. You see all the smoke coming out of the top, out of that little funnel. Wow. This is great. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. What a great steam train. Now, I've been in my loft this week doing some clearing out, and I've come across an old train set. Look there. You can see that red funnel. And it's reminded me that I know a rhyme all about a train and a station. Let's give it a try. Down at the station early in the morning See the little puffer trains all in a row See the engine driver pull the little lever One, two, three and away we go! Wow boys and girls, you might like to try singing that this week but it made me think this week about making a train I've used a kitchen roll and then I've cut it in half so it means that I've cut it into two parts like that. This one I could have painted and I might do that later this week but I've given my train one, two, three, four, five, six wheels, two big wheels for that I needed something that was a circle shape, that's something that's round. And I put it on a piece of card, drew around it once and then again. So I've done it two times. And then I have to cut out those circles. Then to make the small circles, I need something small that's round. There we go, look, this is a circle shape on the end of this top. We did the same using the card, grown up to help me, cut out, and then using the glue, I've glued the wheels on. And then with my pen, I've coloured the middle bits in just to make the middle bit of the wheel. Now, I have to make the little bit where the engine driver sits. So for, to do that, I got a piece of card again and cut my piece of card into a rectangle shape. There's a rectangle, one, two long sides, one, two short sides. And then I folded the middle bits in like that. So we've got a top that would fit on the top of my kitchen roll. So I would need to glue that on. And then, this was tricky, I cut out a funnel my funnel looks a little bit like a capital T, straight across the top, down the middle. And then that, I made a little cut. Again, a grown-up needs to help you with this, in the top. And I could slide my funnel in. And there we go. There's your little train. Have fun if you make one this week. And stay safe, everybody. And I'll see you soon. Bye.